What is up everybody, Hungry Cabion here. This video is brought to you by buyptcgocodes.com. They are sponsoring us. Um, they've also given me a nice little uh, promo code. So if I want to add these to my shopping cart, yes, I want 50 Darkness Ablaze packs, please. Oh, look at that, I already have 50 in there. And I've already applied my, uh, <laughs> my uh, coupon code, Cabion5, to get 5% off. So if you're interested in codes, please check them out and tell them I sent you. What is up everybody? Hungry Cabigon here. I have got some more Rebellion Clash for you today. I keep forgetting. Yeah, it's Rebel Crash. Rebel Clash in English. Rebellion Clash in Japanese. I have 10 packs. I didn't buy these. I actually won them, which is always nice because uh, it only cost me $5 for 10 packs, which is good. So normal price would be like 1600 if you pay full price so nice and cheap basically we want bosses orders or we want uh what's the other good thing in this scoop up net is also in this set which is quite expensive we'll take either or that would be very nice haven't pulled a boss in a while but i'm also skeptical sometimes about the packs from this place because we never seem to get anything good out of the packs so I'm kind of wondering what's the deal with that maybe they're um, like after they get something good they're like putting them in there I don't know but anyway they're cheap so you know we can't complain if we get something out of it it's a win um, so yeah 10 packs today kind of the, the usual this is not the most recent set obviously but it does have some very good cards it really only has two really good cards in it to be honest the rest are kind of whatever but if we can get a scoop up net that's very good if we can get a boss even better and we you know we always why does it look so dark we also have the possibility of getting a full art boss which would be nice let's see what we can do all right pack number one let's have a look get a scissor okay little trubbish little uh, sand castle Okay, that's pretty good. We got Dragapult V first pack. Can't complain with that. That's a nice pull. Surprisingly cheap in Japan. I don't know, do people still play Dragapult so much? I guess Eternatus is like the new thing, but I mean, even Eternatus is like not that expensive in Japan. I was kind of surprised when I saw the price um, of the singles, like less than $5, considering how much it seems like it's getting played seems pretty reasonable all right what can we get we want that scoop up net please that would be sweet okay what have we got in here seismato just breaking rocks as he likes to do i suppose get in there that pack was uh not as nice as the first one but still not too bad we got a trainer it's always good i always I hate the packs where you just get five, like, regular Pokemon. Just like, come on, give me something good. Okay, can we get something good in this one? Oh, looks like it. there might be something in this pack. What's it going to be? All right, we got another Toxtricity VMAX. I have so many, but we will take it. I still really like the look of this card. I mean, it's not bad. It can do 240 damage, but you got to have the poison going on. And I don't know. It's not always the easiest to do, but these packs so far seem pretty good, honestly. But the funny thing is, like, we really just want that one hollow. Even just the, the scoop up net, like I said, is worth more than those. So that's really what we want to see, if possible. Got another Seismitoad. Got another Dadamaka. Fairy looking pretty cute. Magma, like that artwork a lot actually. And we got the Beware. See, that's the kind of pack I'm talking about. You're like, yeah, we got some cool artworks, but at least like throw me a trainer or something. Come on. That's kind of, um, I guess that doesn't happen in English packs. You must at least get like a trainer or two in every pack because you got 10 cards. But I guess like over the course of, you know, a box, it probably evens out. Just seems like you're kind of like, oh. All right, we got capture energy. That's good, actually. Very nice. We'll take that. 
Wow, that's a terrifying looking thing if that was coming towards you. Okay. No, no scoop up net yet. No boss. What are we, ha are we halfway through? So we've got five to go. We've had some pretty good luck so far. But let's, let's be greedy and ask for something really nice today. Okay. Got the little vulture to go with the big vulture. Scoop up net. Yes! <laughs> we called it. Very nice. So that's definitely the best thing we've got so far. Very good. Um, probably, yeah, like a cool five bucks for that card, which is pretty surprising. So we've, we've already done well. We want to be really greedy and get that boss though. That's what I really want to say today. But we'll take another net. That would be sweet. Now, because these packs are kind of essentially random, we're not guaranteed our kind of par of five, you know, shinies. Um, I sh shouldn't say shinies. Five hollows are better, but we could still get it. Still got three more packs. But yeah, that would be a typical par for ten packs. Usually one in every two packs you get a hollow or better. But yeah, because these are just loose packs, no guarantees of that, unfortunately. Not that there is ever a guarantee, but it's like, on average, it's pretty likely. Got a Spiritomb. Comia Spiritomb, which I do like. Very happy with that net though. I'm definitely very glad to see that. Can we get something else though? Because the we haven't even seen a hollow yet. Oh, we got another capture energy, that's nice. Take that. But we've only got one pack left, so the the hits have been good, but they've just been very infrequent. It's very surprising. Where's my hollows? Alright, last one. Let's go, come on. If this has got a boss, I will be so happy. I don't think it's got a boss because I can see that it's something shiny back there. What is it? Oh my gosh. Okay. We got another... I just get so many of these. We got another Toxtricity VMAX. So, I mean, honestly, pretty good for 10 packs. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Just strange that we didn't even get a holo. It's pretty weird. Uh, and again, like, they're random packs, but it's weird to get a V, two VMAXs, and no holo. It's pretty un uncommon kind of scenario to happen. But we'll take it. It's pretty good. We got the net that we were looking for, so. That's pretty nice overall, but those Toxtricity VMAXs, man, if they ever become valuable, I got tons of <laughs> I could just pull them every time. Uh, anyway, that was pretty good, I have to say, for my $5, I'll take that. Uh, let me know what you think, guys. What do you want to see? Like, I've got, like, I've got quite a lot of mystery packs at the moment, which I just have to film. Uh, we've still got, like, three weeks until the next set comes out, though, so I want to kind of not just only have mystery packs every day, but I don't know. Let me know what you think. A lot of the sets are kind of not really particularly worth opening just because there's nothing crazily good in there. Interesting thing I have seen though is that the tag all stars kind of seems to be available again. And if you can pull the golden Reshizard, it's worth like over a hundred dollars now, which is crazy to me. But uh, all the gold cards are actually quite expensive. And the Dedene full art is like 20 bucks. Like there's some good stuff in there, but they are, it is 500 yen a pack, which is obviously more expensive than usual. So, um, you know, we got to get a box really to make it worthwhile. And like, just knowing my luck, there's pretty high chance we're just going to get like a wishy-washy full art or something as the, as the secret rare in the box. I don't know. There is always the possibility of getting a God pack again, which is good. So... I don't know, maybe we'll get a box of that. Let me know what you think. We'll see. I'm kind of assessing the options at the moment. We'll we'll kind of press on. But I'm really, really looking forward to the next few months. There's a good few sets coming out. And I, I really want to get that fat Pikachu VMAX. It looks sweet. Um, so yeah, anyway, like I said, that's it for now, guys. Let me know what you think. Check out the channel for more videos. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. Take it easy.